Hi everyone, so I just thought I'd come on and do a little video. You'll have to excuse the <laughs> state of me. I have been putting new bushes in one of our scooters as Tara was stop, start, stop, start, stop, start all the way home from Brickburns last week. So uh, yeah, I've just been doing that. But um, just wanted to come on and talk about a different side of scooter buddies. This weekend we sadly lost one of our Worthing members and I'm just sat here thinking that's why I started recording because I thought I'd share it it does upset us and it's it's a bit like when you do care work and people say you know don't get attached you know because you know it can happen any time type thing and you can't you can't help but get attached a bit you can't because you build friendships it's not we don't just go to these groups thinking you know we're just running the group that's it you know, we go home and turn off. We don't. We care about our members a lot. You know, they are, as we call it, the Scooter Buddies family. And it is really sad. But I was just thinking, you know, this lady, she really enjoyed Scooter Buddies, you know, and she benefited from it. Um, she didn't know she was going to pass away. It happened very quickly. But it's nice to know that we gave her... A, a group to go to where she felt understood and she had a laugh and we do make a difference and that's what we set out to do and it really does make you realise that well, the friendships we've created th these groups mean something, you know and um, we shall miss her But we're very glad we met her and glad of the memories that we've got with her. Um, so, yeah, there's, there's, there's that side to it. But um, you just got to think of good times. And we want to create memories with our group members. 100% and we love it. So, yeah, little one from me. Just, uh, you know, just thought I'd let it out. But, yeah, all right. Love you guys. Bye.